To celebrate St. David's Day, Explore Science Discovery Centre is looking at some cutting edge science that is coming from Wales. Something you may not know is that parts of the brand new James Webb Space Telescope were built in North Wales. The Webb Space Telescope, unlike the Hubble Space Telescope, which observes the universe in visible light, will be looking for infrared light. This type of light is something that we cannot see with our eyes but can see it using an infrared camera. Infrared radiation is felt as heat, so anything that gives off heat also gives off infrared light. We are going to have a look at some of the hidden processes infrared light can show us. When we add our hot water to a tank of cold water, we can't really see a lot because they are both clear liquids, however when we look using our infrared camera we can see the hot water represented by the orange and the red colours rising and the cold water represented by the blue and purple colours sinking this is called convection. Convection can happen in seas, the atmosphere and even your oven. The next method of heat transfer is conduction. We can show conduction in action by using this book. We cannot see that with our eyes, however, when we look through our infrared camera, we can see that warm handprint has transferred through multiple pages. The final method of heat transfer is called radiation, and this is the type of heat transfer that the James Webb Space Telescope will have to look for. We have heated a screw using a Bunsen burner until it is glowing red hot under our infrared camera. When we see it with the naked eye, we cannot really tell how hot it is, but by looking through our infrared camera, we can see how hot our object is by looking at how bright the glow of the infrared light is. 